In this lesson, we're going to talk about how to calculate your monthly mortgage payment. So let's say if you take out a mortgage to buy a home, let's say the face value of the loan is 400k. And let's say this is a 30 year loan. And the interest rate we'll say it's a, a 5% fixed annual interest rate. With this information, what is the monthly mortgage payment? How can you calculate it? Well, there's a formula that you could use. The monthly payment is going to be the principal times the annual interest rate divided by N. And all of this is going to be divided by 1 minus 1 plus R over N raised to the negative NT. So in this problem, the principal is basically the balance of the loan, which is 400K. R, so let's write this down. So P is 400,000. R is the annual interest rate which is 5%, but we need to convert that to a decimal. So if you take 5% and then divide it by 100, this is going to be 0 0.05. So that's the value that we need to plug in for R. N is the number of payments made every single year. Since we're trying to calculate the monthly payment, and there's 12 months in a year, N is going to be 12. T is basically the term of the loan in years. So this is a 30 year loan or it has to be paid back in 30 years. So T is 30. Now, all we need to do is plug this information into the formula and that's going to give us the monthly payment that we have to pay back in 30 years every month to pay this balance off. Now, let's go ahead and plug this information in and get the monthly payment. So we have P, which is 400,000, and then times R, R is 0 0.05, divided by N, N is 12, and then that's going to be divided by 1 minus 1 plus R over N, so 0 0.05 over 12, raised to the negative, don't forget that negative sign, n is 12 and then times t or times 30. So let's do this one step at a time. So it's going to be 400,000 times 0 0.05 divided by 12. That's 1,666.6 repeated. Now I'm going to plug in 1 plus 0 0.05 divided by 12 and get the decimal value of that part. So that's 1.00416 repeated. 12 times 30 is 360. So in 30 years, you're going to make 360 monthly payments. Now, let's go ahead and plug this in. By the way, you may want to add a few sixes after the decimal to get a more accurate answer. And don't forget to add the parentheses inside the brackets as well. So the answer that I got is $2,147.29 if you round it. It's 2147.2865, but I rounded to the nearest cent. So that is the monthly payment 
that you need to pay back for this loan, given this information that we have here.